Hi, I'm Andy with AMA and Marketer. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to migrate your WordPress website inside of the CRM called Go High Level. Let's get started. In a previous video, we created a WordPress website inside the Go High Level system. Now, one of the features that they advertise in here is that you can import your existing website in this area right over here. I've actually found that that doesn't work as well as I would like it to. Plus, on top of that, it takes another 30 minutes for it to actually finish. And I know I can make this go a lot faster from past experience. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So we have our basic website here that we created in the Go High Level system. And as you can see here, we have that demo page that I created earlier. If you'd like to watch that video, you can go to it right over here. We're going to wipe away this website and import another site right into here. This is the old website that I have. This is just a dummy site on a completely different server that I'm going to use and import right into Go High Level. All I got to do first is I'm going to log into the back end of this old website. And I've already downloaded and installed the plugin that makes this whole thing work. It's called All-in-One WP Migration. If you need to install it, all you got to do is go to Plugins. You're going to click on Add New and you're just gonna look up all in one. And it should pop right up, right here in the center. You'll look for this logo right here. Now since I've already installed it, I'm just gonna go to the area. In order to make the file that's gonna do the actual transfer, all I need to do is click export to file and it's going to prepare the export for me and when it's ready i'm going to download this file and i'm going to upload it to go high level i click on download and it starts downloading immediately now all i need to do is go to the go high level website that i already created and install that wpress file so let's log into the back end first i'm going to go to the admin area i'm going to log in and as you can see, I've already installed the plugin for all-in-one WP migration. So I just go to it on the left-hand side. I click on import. I click on the import from file. I'm gonna go to my old file right over here. And I'm gonna just upload it. It's only gonna take about a minute. Now it's gonna give me a warning. It's gonna tell me that once I click proceed, my old website's gonna go away and the website that I'm importing is gonna be the one that exists here. So it wants to make sure that I have a backup of the old website, which I might have done. But in this case, I'm not gonna do it because this is just for demo purposes. So I'm gonna click on proceed. And now it's transferring that site from the other server right in here. And as you can see, it went really, really fast. It didn't even take that 30 minutes that we were warned about earlier. I click on finish and let's check the home page of the new site that we've created. I click on home right over here. And as you can see, that old site has moved over to go high level. I can tell because of the URL right over here. If I go into the back end, I can see right over here that URL is the same. See right there? and then back again. Now all I need to do is log into the back end and I'm ready to roll. Now that I've done that, I actually want to restore the site that I originally created in Go High Level. It's a very simple process to do. All I need to do is go back into Go High Level, go to Backup, and choose which instance I'd like to restore from. This is one of my favorite parts of Go High Level is that they're continuously backing up your WordPress website. So if you did something a day ago and you wanna roll the website back, it's a really simple process. So I'm just gonna hit Restore, which as you can see, I've already experimented with. I type in the code that they give me to confirm. I start the restore, and it's gonna give me this little warning that while I'm doing this, the site's not gonna work properly, which is completely expected. Now that that's completed, I'm gonna go check out and see if that site is working. So I'm gonna to go to that tab, I'm gonna hit refresh. And as you can see, the site that I created with the demo page is back because I restored it from the backup. Again, one of my favorite parts of Go High Level is that they back up the website every single day for me. And that's all you need to do to not only migrate your website to Go High Level, but to also restore it from a backup. If you like this video and the content that we're creating, don't forget to like and subscribe and come back around for some more Go High Level tips and tricks. See you in the next video.